Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. India and France are long standing strategic partners in the Indo Pacific. To mark the 25th anniversary of Indo French partnership, both countries have agreed to adopt a roadmap to set course for the bilateral relationships up to 2047, which will celebrate the centenary of India's independence. and the centenary of diplomatic relations between two countries and 50 years of strategic partnership france is one of the india's key partners in the development of a self-reliant defense industrial and technological base celebrating the 25th anniversary of indo french strategic partnership on 14th july 2023 many major announcements have been made for which all of us were eagerly waiting The first one is the co-development of a powerful engine for AMCA Mark II. As per Ministry of External Affairs press release, in future India and France will extend their groundbreaking defense cooperation in advanced aeronautical technologies by supporting the joint development of a combat aircraft engine. A roadmap for this project will be prepared jointly by Safran and DRDO by the end of year 2023. Both countries are also working on adopting a roadmap on defense industrial cooperation india is setting up a technical office of drdo at its embassy in paris france has also agreed to support industrial cooperation for motorization of heavy lift helicopters under the indian multi dual helicopter or imrh program with safra helicopter engine france To enable progress on the IMRH program, a shareholders agreement between HL and Safran Helicopter Engine has been concluded for engine development. These ventures are in line with the spirit of trust that prevails between India and France in sharing the joint development of critical components and technology building blocks based on the successful Indo-French expertise in technology transfer. The contract has also been concluded between Safran Helicopter Engine and HL for transfer of technology of forging and casting for Shakti engine which powers HL's helicopter such as LH Dhruv light combat helicopter and light utility helicopter following the DAC acceptance of necessity for procuring 26 Rafale marine for Indian navy the government on 15 July has also announced the selection of Rafale M for navy's aircraft carrier the indian government announced the selection of Rafale to equip in the navy with latest generation fighter four of the 26 rafal m will be a trainer variant the delivery of the aircraft will begin within 3 years of the signing of the contract it may take additional 1 year to sign the deal as price negotiations are underway the marine version of the fighter jet will be slightly different given that they will operate from the aircraft carrier deck the nose and main landing gear of the naval version have been reinforced The Rafal M nose gear also incorporate jump strut technology in the shock absorber to give aircraft an angle of attack during catapulting. The naval version of aircraft also carries a wide range of weapons including anti-ship missiles, air to surface missiles and radar meant for maritime operations. The Indian Navy Rafals will be integrated with AM39 Exocet anti-ship missiles with a range of 70 km depending on the attitude and speed of aircraft the Exocet AM39 enables aircraft to remain at a range from enemy air defenses it is a subsonic missile which can carry 165 kg of warhead Rafal has also been integrated with Mica and Meteor beyond visual range missiles hammer air to ground precision guided weapons and scalp long range standoff weapon with its 10 ton empty weight Rafale is fitted with 14 hard points 13 on Rafale Marine five of them are capable of carrying heavy ordnance or drop tanks total external payload capacity is more than 9 tons for Rafales the addition of Rafale M will take total number of Rafales operated by India to 62 including 36 of under air force it will also ease the logistics and training between navy and air force Following the success of Scorpion submarine construction program or Project 75, the state-run Mazgao Dock Limited and France Naval Group has signed a memorandum of understanding for construction of three additional Scorpion submarines. The addition of three Scorpion class submarines fitted with DRDO's EIP will supplement the fast aging out submarine fleet of Indian Navy. At the same time, it will keep the submarine building pipeline at MDL busy for another 7 to 9 years which is almost idle after the launch of Bakshi. 
the 6th and the last submarine being constructed under project 25 this was today's update please let us know your views on this in comment section if you like the video do not forget to like share and subscribe with this i would like to say goodbye and jai hind we'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector